Well, good morning, everybody. Welcome back to Shutters and Speed. You join me today where we're going to be doing something a little different on this really beautiful, bright, warm, sunny July day. So, as we say here in Norfolk, run them their titles, boy, and I'll tell you all about it. Yeah, so welcome back to Shirts and Speed. Today we're heading off to a place called the Raptor Foundation, which is between Chatteris and Huntington. I'm not entirely sure where exactly yet because I've never been there before. Um, now, if you look at the banner on my uh, YouTube channel um, site, as it were, you'll see that there's a picture of an owl, and that'll sort of give you some indication from that statement as to what we're up to. Um, before, when we've been out and about in the car like we are today, we've been off to either photograph motorbikes or indeed uh, racing cars. But today we're off to photograph birds of prey. Um, the, Ra the Raptor Foundation is apparently a charity that um, rescues birds of prey and re, re sort of vitalizes them, as it were, and gets them back into the wild. But it also actively manages and conserves wildlife especially birds of prey so it's a very worthwhile thing to do and they have a good collection of birds at their centre here um, and I'm going to go there on their uh, photographic day to take some pictures. Now normally when I'm taking wildlife stuff and I do do quite a bit um, I'm buried in a hedge somewhere with all my camo gear on or I'm sneaking up on stuff or, in, or I've spent hours waiting in hides um, for certain species to appear but today is much more organised and it's going to be, I suppose, far easier. Um, so there are two reasons I'm going, really. One, I think, is to um, the fee that I've paid to go is going to help with their work, which is a great thing, I think. And also, it'll give me a good opportunity to update my portfolio with some really good, sharp, crisp uh, pictures of varying types of birds of prey. So they've got a lot of species there that are probably not native to this country, so they're not necessarily the ones I'm interested in. Um, I'm hoping that they've got a good range of more native species as well, so we'll see how we get on. So, without further ado, you'll join me at the Raptors Foundation Centre, and we'll see how we, how we uh, carry on. Well, we carried on very well. The staff at the centre were absolutely brilliant and here are a few photographs that I've managed to capture during the course of the uh, a very exciting day. Well, here we are on the way home from the Raptor Foundation Centre. We've had a fabulous day photographing all the birds of prey, um, both on some realistic perches, it has to be said, in very natural surroundings and also in flight as well. Some of the in-flight stuff was a bit challenging, but uh, I think we got one or two nice images. Now, I know that this has been a little bit different from what I've done before, but uh, wildlife photography is something that I enjoy. Um, and uh, this was a good day spent uh, updating the old wildlife portfolio with birds of prey. So that was great. Um, so if you've uh, enjoyed the pictures and the footage that you've seen so far, then I hope that you'll um, take the opportunity to like and subscribe. Um, and that will obviously keep you up to date with all the stuff that is happening on the channel. So uh, that's about it for now, I think. So without further ado, this is Shutters and Speed signing off for now, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye.